Well, as a follow-up to the video that I did uh, talking about the row rowing machine, I uh, I did go to the stair stair stepping stair master machine. I tried to find uh, a way to record data from the machine to my Phoenix 5X, and I couldn't figure it out. So I don't know if somebody out there knows a way to get that data into my watch or onto you know Garmin Connect that'd be great but I, I just put it as a walk and I kept my arms swinging and that is tough I actually kept both arms swinging I was going very slow I mean I had 175 watts but anything under 200 on a machine like that is slow but my heart rate was really high um, I mean, I stayed in the anaerobic, uh, you know, the one, 127 to 131 area, and I burned calories. But, it, uh, yeah, I'll just have to enter in the steps and um, the data and see how it records in that, in that walk modality. I, I get discouraged sometimes about making some of these videos. I, I just wonder, you know, like, am I doing it just for myself or... You know, look back, man. Uh, today I watched the Ironman Triathlon. I think it was pre-recorded from last year, 2016. But this older guy, he's 83. He actually came in under time, and one time he messed it by six, six seconds. Some, some incredibly small number. But um, in 2016, I believe is was what the show they were showing on on TV today. Somebody called me and told me that it was on, and I didn't even know it. But I tuned in. 83-year-old. He's the oldest competitor to finish the race, and that just gives me a target. You know, and like I said, I'm just I get dis disillusioned about how, why I'm I'm making these videos, and I incorporate. Uh, air, I mean. Now I have so much ways to track my data. I wish I had this 10 years ago, but I, I didn't. And um, I can see that you can't progress unless you really understand, you know, calories in, calories out. You understand your sleep time, your rest time, uh, recovery time. I mean, when you put it all together, you know, it's your legs it's your core and it's your arms and shoulders and with the right data you can improve exponentially it looks like i don't know how far and how fast i can really go but i know this one year is going to turn into another year into another year and and before you know it i mean i'll be competing at the age of 83 85 90 and be very healthy doing it because i do understand that I control my destiny with my DNA and the aging process can be reversed and I'm proving it every day that's why I'm making these videos it's not about the audience that's watching me now it's about the people that are meant to see these videos to change their life and that I'm doing something that's not common it's not normal to say the things I say and do the things I do, and but it, it is normal in the circles that I run in, uh, the awakening community on the internet. They, some of them really get this, but some of them are not physically like they could be. But that's their, that's their destiny. All right. It sounds like a bunch of ego, but I want to counsel counsel that out right now. None of this has to do with me looking good for any purpose of the ego. I do it to stay in right mind consciousness. I need to exercise because of a lot of reasons I can't go into. But um, physically and mentally, I, I feel so much better. I've taken months off and I have crashed physically. My back and my left leg get useless and I get sedentary I get to where I mean I, I just hurt I have to have a, a workout program all year round that's just all it is to it winter summer 
boy the weather hadn't been cooperating and that's that is weird I can make a whole video why I think the weather all across the country has been abnormal it's, I'll just say this and I'll make a video about it maybe later it's the collective subconscious being so the sleeping mind it being so inundated about this stupid war that could possibly be Armageddon and take us all out of the game has got this funk hanging in the air it has got to be released and I think it's going to be released here real soon from everybody and there's new energy and I know it's coming it's more of the photon of the photon belt and it will it will help all right I rambled on long enough I don't even know if I said anything worthwhile but I will say this I am happy that I even have a YouTube channel that ain't been totally taken away. I have been penalized so much that I do it now only for the fun of it. I was doing it because I thought one day I could turn myself into Casey Neistat. Now, was that ego? No, that was because I wanted to help wake up the world and do it at a level like Casey. Casey puts up a video and shortly it gets 6 million views. I put up a video and shortly it gets 6 views. Over a period of time it may get, it may get 50 views. But um, every now and then I put up a video and it just takes off. It gets, you know, 20,000 views. But some of my best stuff gets censored. In other words, it doesn't go anywhere. You won't see it on your feed. I think it gets blocked to tremendously. But And those videos are controversial. I know this. I know this. But that's why here lately I've been putting up video about working out. <laughs> riding bikes and triathlons and, you know alpacas oh yeah alpaca buddy puts a smile on my face i you know those videos should get thousands and thousands of views and dang if they're not even getting uh, hardly any and uh but it helps me in the algorithm of of youtube being able to when i do put out you know some truth or a lot of times now these videos ain't coming from me they're coming from collaborators that i work with and you know i help and whether they know it or not, I love helping them. I love their work. I, I love their mindset. And so I, you know, I collaborate. All right. I got to go. Y'all be good. Thank you for watching this video all the way to the end. If you did, you're a special person and I love you. I'm sending you light and love for doing that. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, do it. And if you like this video, leave a comment. In the end run, it helps me get this message out about the stuff I be talking about. Thank you.